Good morning to you all once again. Uh, let me wish the chief guest for today's inaugural Pradyumna Vyas, who is a former director NID, senior advisor to CII, and director World Design Organization. I am also uh, very happy to be in the presence of Dr. Sri Shalimbai Divatiya, honorary joint secretary, SVKM, and mentor. I, may say, I welcome him to this inaugural. Professor Manisha Fadke, Director, School of Design. Dr. Meena Chintamunini, Registrar in MIMS. Faculty members, my dear students and parents. Let me welcome you all to the NMIMS School of Design virtual inaugural of the fifth batch. Let me at the outset congratulate students for coming through an important phase of their career very successfully. And I must say, although results of the 10 plus 2 stage is not a doubt, results are not a doubt, I'm sure that all of you will be coming through with flying colors. I also wish to acknowledge your correct choice in opting for a career in design, which is the talk of the day and very popular among students. I also wish to applaud you for making a smart choice in choosing the school of design which has got its own reputation over the last four years built across this higher education sector. And I must also make a special mention of your fortitude and courage. In spite of these difficult times, you have maintained composure and focus on your career prospects. I wish to acknowledge all the parents and students for the strength that they've shown during these difficult times. Sneha already mentioned something about the university, but I should mention something more about it, which will give you a little bit, little bit of insight into what NMIMS University is all about. NMIMS University received the university status, deemed to be university status in 2003 from the UGC MHRD. Ever since, the university has grown leaps and bounds. And this growth is clearly echoed in the acceptability of programs, placement records, rankings, research, and so many parameters on which a higher education institute is judged and recognized. This is also because of the laurels that students have brought to us from different schools. And I must say that the School of Design is also contributing to it in a big way. The initiation of the School of Design was planned about five years ago. It has gone through several stages of iterations, development and approvals, and so many processes over the last five years. Professor Manisha Fadke has put in a lot of efforts to put together a school program, which she is very fond of in terms of infrastructure, curriculum, faculty, and so many other things that you see today. She has taken a lot of pains to ensure that the requirements of a design school are met to the smallest detail. What you see today is a journey after a lot of sweat and toil. When the school was taking shape, a lot of thought has gone into the uh, area as to uh, what should be the direction of the school. As you all know, worldwide design schools have kept focus on several domains like architecture design, which our architecture school also pursues, graphic design, media design, fashion design, and so on. The NMIMS School of Design had its focus on humanizing technology. In today's world, technology has become an integral part of our life and business. Without technology, nothing can move ahead. Even today's program, for that matter, we couldn't have had. Human technology is so relevant, more so in today's times, and it is ever increasing. In such a phase, design thinking approach can make life easier and technology user friendly. In fact, technology in technology, the domain of human computer interaction is expanding its frontiers at a very rapid pace day by day. Coming from an engineering background, I must mention something about the need for design. When we talk of a design in engineering, one of the graduate attributes that we talk about is that the student should be able to demonstrate ability to deliver complex design. And we lay a lot of emphasis on complex design. And in the respective knowledge, in the respective domain, they should deliver a very complex design. While we normally carry design as per engineering principles, 
Other factors like sustainability, material preferences, aesthetics, environmental consciousness, alternative approaches, and other complexities like user experience, user perspective, gives an engineer multiple choices to choose from and recommend finally, which find acceptability from the user. In all the accreditation trainings that we carry out, these principles are emphasized and highlighted. I must say that design therefore involves a wider perspective. It is a holistic approach to any problem and tackles all complexities, including aesthetics. While designing the curriculum for this program, all these factors have been thought at length. The academic bodies had extensive deliberations on all these issues. For you, the fifth batch, the delivery, absorption, and application starts now. Realizing the importance and design importance of design thinking approach, you will find that at NMIMS, this has become a philosophy and is now not only a part of the curriculum in many schools, but is also an important part of the university vision and mission. As a fifth batch, you are all going to be torch bearers and ambassadors of the school. In fact, the initial batches have set the standards and brought a lot of good things to the school, a lot of laurels to the school by participation in different activities, not only in, uh, nationally, but also internationally. Their achievements have uh, bring a lot of responsibility on you and there's something which you can benchmark with. I am sure that you as students will enjoy the ambience at SOD when you do come to the school physically. I urge all students to make the best use of all the facilities at the school and make your stay enjoyable and academically fruitful. I wish Professor Manisha Fadiki all the best in her journey in the quest of excellence which she always pursues in the design education. With the skill, competencies, persuasion skills, enthusiasm, and the team that she has put together, I am sure that the school will shine and make us proud. Thank you. Stay safe and secure. We hope to see you at the campus shortly. Thank you.